Howdy YouTubers, it's the Texas Log Dog, and just when I think I've finished upgrading my generator shed, I always think of something else to do. See those red cayenne colored flakes? Well, they're actually, um, it's actually Carolina Reaper. It's the world's hottest pepper, and this stuff is supposed to be 2,000 times hotter than a jalapeno pepper. And I put it in the corners of the generator shed uh, to keep out mice and, and other uh, varmints. So this should be a deterrent. I've got it right under the generator and in each corner. And this stuff is potent. So I uh, wanted to show you and let you know about the Carolina Reaper. Kind of show you the rest of the generator shed. And here's another update. That's the Braun Work Light. And... This thing really just comes in handy. It has two settings, a high and a low, and I don't know what the runtime is, but uh, I'm gonna post a picture uh, of it via the uh, Harbor Freight website. So just, just check out how it illuminates the box. So, uh, you know, when you go in there and you're, you're kind of stressed out that the power's out, you definitely, when you're working around power equipment, you wanna have good lighting, and this thing delivers guaranteed. Uh, you can see, yeah, and I know some of you are wondering, hey, why do you have two fans? So that uh, one that's pointing directly at the radiator, it's uh, it's redundant because the ES6500 has its own internal uh, fan. So that's just in case um, the internal fan fails, uh, the generator will still stay cool since this is a water-cooled unit. So I'm really happy with the Braun work light. Um, I'm really happy with the Carolina Reaper um, as a deterrent to varmint because they can get in your generator and, and really mess things up. So thanks for listening, guys. I appreciate you all stopping by. Here's a picture of the work light. Carolina Reaper, the world's hottest pepper, 2,000, 2,200,000 something on the Scoville scale. So 